Hello learners, welcome to Learn City. Our course title for this lecture is Adaptive Software Development. In this class, we embark on a journey through time to how agile methodologies revolutionized software development, leading us to the adaptive and collaborative processes we rely on today. The journey of agile methodologies is a testament to the software development industry's continuous evolution. Today, we delve into the roots of agile tracing its development from traditional methodologies to adaptive software development, ASD, a pivotal approach in today's dynamic project environments. Now, let us listen up and be attentive. In the pre-agile era, software development was dominated by structured, liner approaches like the waterfall model. But these methods showed limitations, struggling with the dynamic nature of projects, leading to the software crisis. The birth of Agile in 2001, through the Agile Manifesto, marked a revolutionary shift, emphasizing individuals, working software, customer collaboration, and response to change. Agile set new foundations for software development. Agile is not one size fits all. From Scrum to Extreme Programming, Lean, and Kanban, each framework offers unique approaches to project management, team collaboration, and adaptability. So, Adaptive Software Development, ASD, emerged in response to the need for more flexibility. With its core phases of speculate, collaborate, and learn, ASD emphasizes continual adaptation and learning. Are we still together? The impact of Agile and ASD is profound, enhancing project velocity, customer satisfaction, and our ability to thrive in volatile conditions. ASD, in particular, fosters a culture of continuous adaptation and learning. The evolution of Agile methodologies culminating in adaptive software development, showcases our industry's relentless pursuit of improvement. This journey not only shapes our present, but also paves the way for future innovations. I hope we understand the evolution. Please, if you any question, kindly direct them to the comment section. It will be attended to. Let us proceed to the Principles of Adaptive Software Development, ASD. You see, in the realm of software development, where change is the only constant, Adaptive software development stands as a beacon of flexibility, collaboration, and continuous learning. Adaptive software development, or ASD, redefines how we think about software projects. Unlike traditional methodologies, ASD is built on principles designed for a world in flux. Let's go into these principles and see how they guide teams towards success. First up is mission-driven planning. ASD places the mission or goal at the forefront, allowing teams to adapt their strategies as projects evolve. This approach ensures that despite the twists and turns, the team's efforts are always aligned with the project's core objectives. We have the collaborative ownership. At the heart of ASD is collaborative ownership. This principle emphasizes shared decision-making and responsibilities fostering an environment of trust and open communication. It's about harnessing the collective intelligence of the team to navigate challenges. We also have continuous adaptation. Don't forget, we are on the principles of adaptive software development. Continuous adaptation is what makes ASD truly agile. It's about being ready to pivot in response to new information or changes in the environment. Through iterative cycles of planning, execution, and learning, Teams maintain their agility and resilience. Another principle is quality focus. Quality isn't just an end goal in ASD. It's woven into the fabric of the development process. A quality focus means integrating best practices and quality assurance measures at every step, ensuring that excellence is a constant pursuit. Lastly, incremental development. ASD champions delivering functional components in short cycles. This approach not only facilitates faster feedback, but also empowers teams to adapt quickly, ensuring the project remains on the cutting edge. These principles of adaptive software development offer a powerful framework for tackling the complexities of modern software projects. By embracing these tenets, teams can navigate the unpredictable with grace and efficiency, turning challenges into opportunities for growth. Take note, Agile methodologies share the common goals of enhancing adaptability and customer satisfaction. But when we zoom in on adaptive software development, we uncover a world tailored for relentless change and continuous learning. Let's dig into the comparison of ASD with other agile methodologies. 
Before we go into ASD, let's quickly recap the overview Agile universe. From Scrum's structured sprints to Kanban's flow-based process, Extreme Programming's technical rigor, and Lean's waste reduction focus, Agile methodologies offer a spectrum of approaches to software development. The core characteristics of ASD. At the heart of adaptive software development are its core characteristics. Mission-driven planning, collaborative ownership, continuous adaptation, and a relentless focus on quality and incremental development. This speculate-collaborate-learn cycle is what sets ASD apart. Let us go to the comparison with other Agile methodologies. Let me give us comparative analysis. Unlike Scrum's structured roles and sprints, ASD embraces a fluid, non-prescriptive process, allowing more freedom to adapt. While Kanban focuses on continuous workflow, ASD is project-centric, tailored for dynamic adaptation to changes. Comparing to XP's emphasis on technical practices, ASD takes a broader strategic view, though both value continuous feedback and quality. Lean and ASD both aim to maximize value, but ASD's cycle of learning distinguishes its approach to project management. By the way, Choosing the right Agile methodology depends on your project's size, team dynamics, and environment. ASD is particularly effective in scenarios demanding rapid adaptation and a deep focus on learning from each cycle of development. Understanding the nuances of adaptive software development compared to other Agile methodologies empowers you to choose the best approach for your projects. ASD offers a path through the unpredictable championing, adaptability, and continuous learning. We have come to an end of this lecture. I hope we have gained knowledge and enough insight on the introduction to adaptive software development. Thanks for joining. Our next lecture is the ASD life cycle. Stay tuned. Do not forget to subscribe and channel your question to the comment section.